Hello there. So today let's talk about Gauss weapons and compare how explosive registry modification impacts our damage outcome with and without demo expert. So straight to the point. Here you can see them all together. Well, first of all, I want to apologize for not being able to line up everything perfectly. But uh, let's care about actual results, not my editing skills. We have girls, pistol, rifle, shotty and uh, minigun. So here I don't use any pair cards that will boost damage except for demo expert of course uh, in the second row. Same for any other buffs uh, and I use mods to deal more crit damage and uh, in case of Gauss Mini we have Tesla Coil Dynamo I believe. A explosive legendary modification is actually can be noticed cause description damage is increased. 17% in case of pistol and rifle, 20 for shorty and 16 for minigun. Demolition expert makes the difference between damage numbers even more noticeable, 25%. But shorty gets only 23. So what do we have? Uh, the highest damage per shot goes to rifle, the highest uh, DPS to minigun of course. Gunslingers keep sucking, uh, those who invested in Gauss shorty build may express their frustration in the comment section. Today we're gonna check uh, Gauss rifle and then Gauss minigun. Let's go with bloody build and uh, Gauss mini has the same damage difference. So if we divide 250 by 198 we roughly get 25% more and electrical damage stays unchanged 24-24. Well well, if we deal with Puppy Hawk the DPS in case of explosive legendary modification gives more points per second. You probably want me to test Eru here, because he has damage reduction buff, so explosion damage would matter less, and uh, maybe a fast fire rate in this case will actually win. But first, the actual difference would be quite low, and second, you gotta be out of your mind if you really want to use Gauss Mini in a boss fight, because this weapon is very expensive and ammo is quite heavy. Anyhow, on paper, Gauss minigun currently should have the highest DP, well, damage per minute, I would say, among all heavies in the game. Because, uh, look, Plasma Caster would kill Puppy Hawk way faster. In case of Gauss shorty, or I mean Gauss rifle, we got the same 25% ish boost with perks and stuff applied. And this is actually huge. Because uh, explosive damage, while being calculated separately, will give way more difference. Uh, well, because damage reduction QF would be way more favorable towards us. Basically, the damage boost that affects only explosive part is quite noticeable. Here we compare our weapon, I mean explosive uh, legendary modification with vital modification, meaning more crit damage, right? And I would say that uh, Gauss Rifle got the biggest buff with this legendary modification once again. <laughs> because it's some sort of multiplier, but only for explosive part, obviously. And uh, what's going on with Tenderizer? <laughs> Sadly, I could not get the explosive number because Puppy Hawk had died right before explosive damage was applied. In both cases, right? For Vital as well. But look at this freaking difference. Now I'm actually looking forward to test Gauss Rifle more deeply because it should be the number one critical damage dealer. Sadly I need to end this video here because it will be rendering for 10 hours already or maybe even more. Yoki Zokis, ladies and gents, big thank you for watching, I will see you later, bye 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 bye.